Hello, kind travelers, and welcome to the Mischievous Mayor. I am your host and weaver of tales, Vinterbjorn. Today is a summarization of Loki's children, the most popular ones, the ones that everybody knows, and just kind of what they're responsible for in mythology. And without further ado, let's get into it. The first three children I want to talk about are from Loki's affair with Angerboda, a giantess that lived in Jotunheim. Now these three children are Fenrir, Jormungandr, and Hel. The first, Fenrir, is the giant wolf who winds up breaking loose of his bindings and swallowing the sun at the end of Ragnarok, challenging and killing Odin before finally being killed by Tyr. The second is Jormungandr, the world serpent. Once the world serpent lets go of his tail from his mouth and rises from the sea, all is flooded and he has a climactic battle with Thor. Thor ultimately kills Jormungandr, but then succumbs to Jormungandr's poison. And the last from Angerboda is Hel. Now, she doesn't really do anything during Ragnarok. She is just the half undead daughter of Loki who resides in Niflheim and rules over Hel, the underworld. She does let Loki take the souls from Hell and use them as his soldiers during Ragnarok. But other than that, that she's kind of indifferent, honestly. Um, and those are his three children from Angerboda, arguably his most popular. The fourth, and a lot of people don't actually realize that this is Loki's child, is Sleipnir. Now, Sleipnir is an eight-legged horse who was Odin's mount and the fastest steed in all of the Nine Realms. Fun fact, uh, Loki is actually Sleipnir's mother, so that's a fun story. We'll get into, we'll summarize that eventually. Uh, but yeah, that's all of Loki's children and what they're responsible for in mythology. Just a brief rundown. I'll probably do more in-depth storytellings later, but I hope you enjoyed, and as always, safe travels. Oh, there is one more child of Loki that I neglected to mention, but that's because he's only really mentioned during Loki's punishment, and that is Loki's son, Nafi? Narfi? It, it's pronounced a couple ways. Um, but he is killed and used to bind Loki after Loki tricks Hod into killing Baldur. So, yeah, I almost forgot about him, but that's because he's only mentioned once.